put you to sleep eventually. <laughs> uh oh. Hello, my beautiful people, and welcome back to the center. We're over here hanging out on Bubble Melon because uh, we had a kind of a failed attempt on trying to get cementing paste, and we need more cementing paste. And we have a problem. It is super hard to find bugs with the frog. Super hard to get cementing paste. I did go off camera. I got a little bit so I can make some supplies to make this into a full-born mission because we need to make us a snail farm. We need a cementing paste farm. We need some automation. And in order to do so, we need to make veggie cakes, which takes honey from bees up in the red forest. And it also takes tree sap up in the red forest so i think it's due time we need to make a base over in the red forest over there now i went ahead and made a bunch of stuff so we could do so i got the stone tree platform already made got a bed made for over there rope ladder to get up and down preserving bin to preserve all the honey and stuff we get and a tree sap tap good to go we are fully loaded i got a little bit of extra food with me now this stuff that's not stacking like it does with the mod here this is just old resources i had in the boxes still old resources will not stack when you apply the mod onto it so that is why that is happening but yes it's time for us to make a base over there i think it's time and we are going to bring bubble melon with us because we might have to take out a bunch of creatures in the area and stuff and we definitely want something super strong that can handle that and of course, we're going to be riding Makita. Oh, I wish I could level their speed. It takes so long to travel in this game. So absolutely long. Oh, you have a level, my friend. Let's go ahead and give you one more in the stand. That won't hurt. Looks like we might be able to run into at least one drop on the way as long as it doesn't disappear. That would be wonderful. Now, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day because I am having a super wonderful day. Chilling, playing some art. It's a good day. We are almost at the blue drop. Oh, please stay there so I can loot you. I hope you're something wonderful, but I wanted to talk about the future of the channel a little bit anyway. Uh, I'm going to start shooting for four videos a week up to five videos a week. I'm going to try my absolute best. Like I said, I'm trying to make this a career of mine because of my set health conditions that the true OGs are aware of. If you are not aware, I do have an autoimmune disease and it is uh, it's starting to get very hard for me to uh, operate in society. And there's no real way I can get so-called assistance, quote unquote, whether it be with doctors and or uh, financial. Oh, we got a tree sap tap. We got an extra one. Raptor set. Oh, we got a better crossbow cook stuff. Oh, my God. That was actually decent. That was a good drop. But yes, I am. Uh, I am unable to get assistance, quote unquote. So I have to make my own adventure. But yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. So this is why I'm choosing to do this. I absolutely love it. It's something I can pertain in and stay consistent. And I can make other people's day a little bit better. Maybe teach someone about, uh, you know, nutrition and well-being and health. Please be something good. Uh, not the best, but I'll take it. The blue drop was better than the purple drop. What was up with it? We have arrived in the red forest. Red forest? Rain forest? Either way, I really like this tree. It's kind of like up on this hill right here. It's like brightly illuminated compared to these other ones. I don't know, it's just drawing me in. I think this might have to be where we place our base. It's right at the beach. Access to water if we need it. Mmm, I think I think this might be it right here. I think I like it. Now let's throw the stone platform on my hot bar. Should we make it low? Yeah, we should probably make it lower, right? That kind of makes sense. Maybe we should make like a double tier. Try and make a second one. Bam. Oh no, was I able to like do a very uh 
don't know if I was able to do a variation or not. Little crap sandwich. You know what? Let's let's do two for here. We'll suck you up. We will grapple up there. And then we'll just pick this dude up real quick. Just like so. Zip up. Oh yeah, there is no variation to the stone tree platform. Okay. What the heck? Do you guys see the bugs crawling on the tree? I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> what is that all about? Hold on. Wow, that's a cool like little aesthetic. Interesting. I am so distracted and mesmerized by these bugs right now. That one's leaving a contrail. He's trying to change the weather. All right, I got all the taps placed where they're supposed to be. These ones look so much better on ASA compared to ASE. They look absolutely amazing. So I think I have to access their inventory at least once to make them start producing. I mean, it used to be glitchy like that. I don't know if it's still like that, but there are a lot of bugs that transferred over from the old game to this game. All right, we got that. We got a preserving bin. We got spark. Is there really bugs crawling on my preserving bin? What? Why? <laughs> Why is that a thing? Do they just crawl all over the place? Oh my god, they're everywhere. It's like an infestation. He's just crawling across my platform. He don't care. Another contrail. Are you trying to manipulate the weather too? I need a little bit of rain up in here if you don't mind. Okay, and final piece of the resistance. We have a rope ladder. Now, oh, I thought this was a different kind of ladder. Uh oh, well, we could build it all the way down. I think we can make a bunch of these. All right, rope ladder. We need more fiber. That's what we're missing. And I probably didn't bring my scythe with me. I did not. <laughs> Oh, dang it. Looks like we're not going to be getting a ladder going down to the bottom. That's all right. We have a flyer. We can get up and down just for the time being until I can fill in those little ladder spots. So we had the sap thing taken care of. Now we need to find bees nests. And we need to run around with the T-Rex. Kill stuff off. Like, what is that down there? Is that copies? That's copies. It really liked my presence, though. That's interesting. But yeah, we're going to probably take out Bubble Melon and just go on a killing rampage. Absolutely decimate everything in the area on the lower deck here. I know there's like a cliff you got to go up to get up there. So we'll try and kill everything on the bottom. Try and find us some bees nests. But before we find a bees nest, I do want to try and get a bear. Because bears are really good at collecting honey. And I know we're going to need a lot of honey. Hi, Bubble Melon. Are you ready to go on a killing rampage? Oh, yeah, you're ready. You're ready for a murdering spree. And stick the landing. Now, I know there's Trudons down here. Kill these stupid copies off. We could use the hide, too. So I think we're starting to run low on hide. I know there's a bunch of Trudons on the beach. I think it was on the other side, though. Culprit spotted. We have one of them here. Have another. Oh, look, he's attacking a deer over there. Is that a bear? It's a bear. Oh, it's a 15. That is garbage. There's a lot of bears everywhere. This is amazing. 85. Oh, my God. He might be the one we need. Hold on. Let me put the T-Rex on passive. You know what? Maybe we could grapple up somewhere and try and shoot him. Or maybe just stand on the T-Rex's head and try and shoot him. <laughs> I mean, we could try that. I mean, if all else fails, we could just kill him with the T-Rex. Hey, buddy, you want to be my friend? Collect honey for me, please? Oh, you know what? Let's put a tracker on you. Hmm. Did not think this through. Really? Just... <laughs> He attacking me? He's attacking me. What is that all about? All right, let's jump down and shoot him. Yep, yeah, you just keep hitting the T-Rex. That's fine. I'll put you to sleep eventually. 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jump back on the T-Rex. <laughs> Hold on, can we like jump off onto the rock up here maybe? Oh, I fell. Are you gonna go to sleep, dude? Oh my god, you're gonna take a little while. Uh-oh, he's gonna hit him up the cliff. Stop it! Go to sleep! Oh my god, now stuff jumping at me! <laughs> Leave me alone! I'll come back, Mr. Bear. Mr. Bear! I don't know why you're just like standing still right there. Okay. Where are you going? Come back. Come back. Screw off, Pego. I'm trying to do business here. Come back, Mr. Bear. I'm almost... Ah, oh, freaking Trudon. Let's take care of this dude real quick. Stupid chicken. Weird chicken thing. No, no, no. Come back. Come back. You getting, you getting sleepy? Put a tracker on his dumbness. There we go. Now we can see his torpor. Are you coming back again? What is going on right now? And now he's running. Dude, make up your mind. All right, I'm going to chase the Pooh Bear around for a second and try and tame him. Yes, he's down. That was such a long chase. That took so long. <laughs> oh, man. Now, I'm pretty sure he just eats meat. So we could give him some prime meat. Let's go kill this Diplo over here real quick. I'm pretty sure these guys give some good prime meat. That wasn't too hard to take that down. I'm glad I got that one. It's only level 80 something. Oh, we got some Trudons over here. We need to take care of them, too. Oh, Bubble Melon, you're so freaking strong. Diplos are so powerful. Yes, I love you so much. All right, let's kill all the fools in the air and get the Terror Bird. Oh, what is going on right now? Are you freaking kidding me right now? Dude, you gotta be kidding me right now. There's a freaking Micro Raptor smacking the bear the whole... Are you kidding me? Oh, man. The taming effectiveness is gonna be awful. That's all right. Let's go ahead and give him some mate. There you go, Mr. Bear. Eat up. Oh, look at the taming effectiveness. 50%. That stupid Micro Raptor. I don't even know why he was attacking him. There's no reason. That's just... I got art. In inherit oxygen mutable. What in the world? He's got an oxygen mutation? That is so not needed. What a... I found a submarine bear? Alright, we're gonna let this fluffy being finish up. Gonna go patrol the area a little bit. See if I can't find me some... Bee nestuses. Maybe clear out some trees so I can actually see around here. Oh my god, I just found a level 145 bear sitting right next door. Are you freaking kidding me right now? Oh, if I had a trap for you. Oh my god, is that a baby? No, that's just a deer. Just a deer. Nothing special. Level 95 deer. Holy crap. We're going to have to come back for that bear. I definitely want to get a trap set. So I could catch it better because, yeah, that's going to take a long time to take down. I don't want to be chasing him around forever. 9,000 Torpor. Oh my goodness. That's a great find, though. That bear is going to stay there. We're not going to murder him. We're just going to let him live for now. Just been scouring through the area. There's a whole bunch of metal nodes. And there's a Bigfoot right here. What level are you? 95. Oh my god. You're a high level, my friend. We got a Bigfoot at home. I can't remember if it's a female or a male. It's been so long. Now, I don't know if the bees' nests are going to be like up on just all the trees. 
I mean, it would probably be easier if I just fly around. It would probably make sense. Well, now that I switched to my bird, it is nighttime and I cannot see a single thing. So we are going to wait out the night. Hey, our dire bear is done too. Go get our dire bear. And yeah, and I will see you guys in the morning. Ah, good morning. It is six o'clock in the morning. We could finally see again. I just kind of AFK through the night. And here we are. We got our bear. Everyone welcome Fur Missile to the tribe. You know what? I forgot. Saddle. I need to figure out how to make a saddle. Hold on. Dire Bear Saddle. Oh, you need more cementing paste? I think I have a little bit at home. Oh my god. We have to go make it again? Alright, well, I'm going to go make this Dire Bear Saddle real quick. And then I will be right back. Just not flying back. From base, dire bear saddle in hand. Let's go ahead and get him out real quick so we can smash it on. Aye. There you go. Now you're looking stylish with your big saddle on it. You know what? Let's give him a quick ride. I just need to. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. I love bears. Bears are the best. And they pick up momentum and just keep getting faster and faster. Best thing ever. So we got. Normal bite attack. Got a swipe attack. Awesome. Oh, what is that? Oh, that's amazing. My little fur missile. Oh, he almost split backwards. That was funny. Do it again. <laughs> so if you walk backwards at the same time as doing the roar, lean back. <laughs> Okay, that's too much. All right, zap you up, friend. All right, Makita's flap around. Let's try and find us some bees' nests. I don't know how high they are off the ground, but uh, yeah, hopefully we find some pretty quickly. I've been wasting all my time up here in the Red Forest, and I have not really done much other than get a somewhat decent level bear, and that's about it. Hold on, is that a bees' nest right there? Oh my god, we found one already. Isn't that just lucky? No, I gotta get the bear up to it. <laughs> Crap. Uh, you know what? I wonder if you could build like a little plat. I can't afford a platform. We're gonna have to like ramp up to it. That kind of sucks. All right. Well, I need to collect materials to get this done. We're gonna get Bubble Melon out because he's gonna be our little protector down here. Uh, yup. There we go. Now we're just going to set you on neutral and you're going to follow us around. You're going to be our little protector. All right, we're probably going to make the ramp. Can we make that ramps? Is that a thing? I can't remember. Nope, just wood. All right, we're going to need a bunch of wood, bunch of thatch, bunch of fiber. Oh, let the collecting montage begin. Okay, as far as I know, I think I have all the resources I need. I've never done this before, so we're just kind of winging it. Let's get out of third person. It's a little bit easier to build in first person. At some point in time, some dino stole my freaking water jar, so I don't have a water jar anymore. So what I'm going to try is I'm going to place a foundation as close as I could get right up under the nest, which is going to be like right here. How close can I get? Come on, turn green. Okay, that's the closest I can get. Now what we're going to do is build walls. That is not the right button. Going to build walls going straight up. As high as we can go, and then we're going to ramp off the walls coming down. And that should give us a perfect ramp going straight up to the rumblebees up there. All right, let's 
put our crossbow on because we need a grappling so we could place a couple more walls here okay i think that's about the closest that we're gonna get now let's see if i could see it on top of the t-rex a little bit better um hmm i think we should go up one more you know what let's try it we'll build off of that and we'll make it work we'll make this work real good now would i be able to just grapple to the structure zip up and then just like ramp off there we go we got the first ramp placed that was extremely difficult for me to do <laughs> now if i just like zip myself up straight like this there we go this is super complicated to place these up here all right i got the ramp like halfway kind of down we just got to build some pillars out which i think i have enough materials on me to do so here we go just make a few th oh we can only make two why why can we only make two we're out of wood yeah that would do it all right i'm gonna go beat up some more trees and then we'll come back here and finish this up all right let's see if i could place the pillars from the back of the t-rex oh i can Oh, that's perfect. Build it all the way down. Extend this ramp out, and we should be able to get up there with the bear and knock us out some bees. Now, are we going to be able to reach the honey nest with the bear? I think. What the crap was that sound? Is that the bees? I have no idea. That freaked me out. That was the weirdest sound ever. Just so we can stretch over a little bit more to it. Oh, it might be a little too high. That's all right. Let's go ahead and try and bring the dire bear up here and do that real quick. So that was fun. We just had a good old art crash. So yeah, at least it wasn't too far back. I have the ramp still half built. Wow, that is just such a bummer why that happens all the time. Oh, well, let's go ahead and fix this up, get our ramp down, make some more pillars because now those are gone and then we'll be good to go. You know, I find it so frustrating that we're still having crashing problems, but these fools at Wildcard are so excited about releasing their new content when everyone is still struggling to run it. Fix the game. Optimize the game. It's not that big of rocket science is it bubble melon tell them but enough ranting i'm gonna go collect some stuff so i can get this ramp build up hopefully we don't have another crash i would be uh super bummed out just about to be finishing off this ramp and check out this bear right here it's another 135 and we have another 145 over yonder like what is going on right now all these super high levels for no reason. I mean, I'm not complaining, but that's nice. That is really cool. He's just like all up in my grill and kind of in the way right now. All right, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to kill this bear off because it is too close to us and I don't need it attacking me while I'm trying to build stuff over here. So we're just gonna take care of you real quick, buddy. I'm sorry about your sacrifice. I'll take your pelt and turn it into something special. All right. I. And finally going to finish the ramp. Bam, just like that. All right, let's get our ceilings once again. It's like deja vu, I swear. Run to the top. Ceiling. Good to go. All right. I am going to save it real quick. And then we're going to try and get some honey. All right, fur missile. We have a mission. Uh oh, I forgot to pick up scope. When you log in, you drop your pet. Go ahead and pick that up. Yeah, the only way I could save is absolutely like logging out to the menu and then coming back. It's the only way I could save. Can I get back on you, please? Pretty please? Thank you. That was crazy. Are you not tall enough? <laughs> You're definitely not tall enough. Uh, can we just put another ramp on the end of this thing? Maybe? Cooperate? Finicky? Wrap? All right, is this tall enough? Oh yeah, get you some. You're off, stupid bees. Oh my God, that's a lot of bees. 
Holy moly. That's a lot of bees. Oh, look, it's the bee queen. How do we... How do we tame the bee queen? I have no idea. Did I even get any honey out of that? Bruh. Why did I not get any honey out of that? Are you kidding me right now? I just built all the way up here and didn't get diddly squat. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh. I think our only bet is to uh, try and get that bee queen. Let's whistle the Rex to follow us. I have no idea how to tame it. I'm assuming it's a passive tame from the stuff I've seen, but where is it? There it is. You coming down, bromie? Come down here. Passive. No, no. What the crap? Okay, maybe I shouldn't whistle past it. Let's just neutral it. Go. Get him. Oh, I'm slowed. Oh, there it is. I need to grab it. I need to grab it. Go. Go. Come here, dummy. Come here, dummy. I'm not going to be able to get it. There's no way. There's no freaking way. I think I need bug repellent to do this. <laughs> oh, scared the crap out of me, bear. Thank you, though. Appreciate it. Oh, that is such a bummer. Man, I am so I'm just so devastated right now. And not only that, we had a crash on top of that. Ugh. All right, I'm going to go pick up the top ramp off of this. I don't know if it's too close to keep the honeybee hive from responding or even if they do. Man, that's such a bummer. That is such a bummer. <laughs> But guys, I think that's going to be all the time we have for today. I'm going to uh, do some time off a of camera, go hunt for some more honeybees, do the same thing and try to get them. I still don't know why I didn't collect any. What is happening? Now there's a Carno attacking. Well, on that note, if you guys find yourself liking the video, please do don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. We are getting super close to a thousand subs and it would absolutely make my day if you guys did. And I would love you forever. And make sure your bell is checked so you can tell when I put up some more awesome content. And guys, we will see you on the next one.